Kapofi was responding to a question by PDM leader Mark Henry Venani, who wanted to know from Kapofi whether the government is releasing Mwilima on medical grounds. The 65-year-old Mwilima has been in prison at the Vendu Correctional Facility and now suffering from a number of chronic illness such as diabetes, kidney failure, and hypertension, among others, and he is now on chronic medication. Former Honorable Mulima in prison. I visited him four times. What are you doing and what is the concerted approach of your ministry to make sure that we relieve this man on conditions of his health? A prisoner that goes every weekend, every week to get dialysis. He doesn't get his food, the correct food stuff that he must get. He's 23, 24 years now in prison. Of course, he has committed an offense. The law found him that. But on condition of humanity, what are we doing? Why are we punishing a man on a deathbed? Other countries are leading us in protecting those that can no longer protect, no longer deliver a, a healthy life. The condition of Honorable Mulima. I've spoken to the, your successor, uh, your, your predecessor, about this situation. It's a situation that needs the attention of the minister and to a point that you need to make a recommendation to the president. You can't have someone on dialysis sitting in prison unabated for years. The issue you raised is, is quite, uh, is quite uh, is, is an issue that uh, of course it's not, a, it's not supposed to be a political issue but it's some maybe humanitarian issue, but uh, I think to an extent it is being considered, I, 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 the possibility exists that that consideration may be given. How soon, when, I don't know, but it is to an extent it was exchanged. There are discussion to that effect. Mwilima and others were arrested on the 4th of August 1999 and charged with high treason and multiple counts of murder and attempted murder in the main Caprivi high treason trial. Timo Andreas, NBC News, Parliament.